Why criticise ideologies? Well, I think the answer is quite obvious, really. Ideologies can be quite dangerous. Various ideologies have various dangers. They vary, they're all different, and yet they share a certain important element. How people think. Not necessarily what they think, what they'll do, but the kind of faith before reason view. The belief ahead of reality view. And as a result, manipulation takes place. Various ideologies tell you how to think, what to think, how to live, how to feel about certain things. They manipulate you, make you think within a certain point of view, certain limited parameters, and as a result control your life. Control, manipulation, exploitation can all be excused in the name of the belief, whatever that belief may be. It's because of how people think. They accept authority. They accept what they're told. And if they do question, they question within certain parameters. If you're given a way of thinking that is so limited that you cannot use the language to express what you mean, your argument against the proposition that you've been indoctrinated with becomes unassailable. When people believe they're following the absolute truth, why should they question at all? When they believe they're dealing with an absolute authority, to question would be blasphemy. Where the ideology doesn't work on its own, they create propaganda. They manipulate the facts, use persuasive arguments to make you believe what they want you to believe. When they aren't manipulating you with the idea of heaven or hell, they're manipulating you with a material heaven or hell. The better future, the utopia they can build, or the hell that will be left, if you do not do what the ideology demands. The idea of associating with people of the belief is promoted. In extreme cases, disassociation with non-believers is also promoted or even enforced as a ruling of the group. A common sign of being controlled by a belief is bringing it up all the time, even inappropriately, arguing about it, even where it is inappropriate in the social or work setting, and in many cases, willful lying. You're willing to lie about the facts, and you know you're lying, because you believe that your truth, your belief, is so important that a little lie for good reasons is well worthwhile. If you believe that you're saving souls, or saving humanity, saving the world, doing the absolute best thing you can do, then you won't care about the setting. You won't care if it's appropriate or not. You won't care if you're lying through your teeth, because you believe that the big picture, this greater truth that you hold, of whichever kind, is more important than anything else which is happening right here, right now. So no matter the scenery, it's still more important for you to pass on your ideology, because you're so heavily indoctrinated in the view that your belief is the only important point that needs to be made. 